Dear students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting further, I would like to tell you something. Please watch video completely and sit with copy pen. And if you find somewhere important, then note it and proceed further. If you find anywhere some problems or difficulties, please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share, and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Now, here is the question based on comprehension, means paragraph questions. A thermal power plant produces electric power of 600 kilowatt at 4000 volt, which is to be transported to a place 20 km away from the power plant for consumers uses. It can be transported either directly with a cable of large current carrying capacity or by using a combination of step up and uh, step down transformers at the two ends. The drawback of the direct transmission is to be large energy dissipations in the method using transformers. The dissipations is much smaller in this method. A step up transformer is used at the plant side so that the current is reduced to a smaller value at the consumers and a step down transformer is used to supply power to the consumers at the specific lower voltage. It is reasonable to assume that the power cable is purely resistive and the transformer are ideal with power factor unity. All the currents and voltages mentioned are RMS values. Before starting the question, have a look to the concept of transformer. As we know that step of transformer having high current convert into low current and low voltage to high voltage. It is useful to where the electricity produced and to propagate to the grid. Okay, grid where the electricity is transposes to the consumers. Okay, so therefore, and here the step down transformer. Here step down transfer means weak current convert into strong current and high voltage into low voltage because you know that very well when supposed to be we have uh, produces or propagate to the current directly to the consumer you know that very well current is showing the heating effect also thermal heating effect i square rt and so therefore most of the energy is wasted in the form of thermal energy so therefore here we have using step down transformer consumer and for the grid and for commercial purpose here the store in the grid that time here current high current into convert into low current and low potential low voltage convert into high voltage. So therefore this formula here the EMF in secondary coil upon EMF into primary coil equal to potential in secondary coil directly proportional. And here the potential in primary coil, all proportions equal only except here the current is inverse proportion here. Okay, because you can see that here uh, interchanges there current in primary coil is greater and here the IS. If IS uh, ES is greater than EP means potential in secondary coil is greater than potential in primary coil, then current in primary coil is increases with respect of the secondary coil. So here the ratio is only changed in the current. Now here is the question based on this paragraph that is uh, if the direct transmission method with a cable of transmit uh, resistance 0 0.4 ohm per kilometer is used the power dissipation in percentage during transmission is here four options are given. Uh, A 20%, option B 30%, option C 40%, option D 50%. First case, we have given the direct transmission, in that case power equal to V into I. Here V is potential and I is current. Here power is given, what is power is given? 600 kilowatts, means 600 kilo convert into watt, means multiply with 1000. Okay, and potential is given 4000 volt. Here 4000 into I, then 600, 1000 divided by 4000, that is I, C0 cancel out, 4, that is 150. Here I equal to 150 ampere. Okay, and now 
we have to find out again when consumer uses this power so here we have using this formula p equal to i square r so here we have get the current 150 but the resistance then for the resistance we have given that 0 0.4 ohm per kilometer and total length of the cable is given 20 kilometer so here net resistance 0 0.4 into 20 kilometer that is 8 ohm per kilometer okay so here we get total resistance r equal to 8 ohm per kilometer okay so now substitute this value here 150 square into 8 how much this is p equal to 225208 and we get here we get 180 kilowatt here we get 180 kilowatt okay so here we get 180 kilowatt power so now we have find out the percentage power dissipations now the percentage of power dissipation is consumed power is 180 here produce power 600 into percentage 20 cancel out that is 30 percent so here power dissipation is 30 percent here b option is correct i hope so you understood this question this question based on this paragraph the questions are here in the method using the transformers assume that the ratio of the number of turns in the primary to that in the secondary in the step of transformer is 1 is to 10 if the power to the consumers has to be supplied a 200 volt the ratio of the numbers of turns in the primary to that in the secondary in step down transformer is here we have given four options options first 200 is to 1 option b 150 is to 1 option c 100 is to 1 option d 50 is to 1 here for step of transformer vs upon vp here potential in the secondary coil and potential in primary coil is equal to equal proportion of ns upon np here ns upon np means number of turns in the coil that is given that primary to secondary that 10 is to 1 and here we have to find out vs because vp means initial potential is given that 4000 so here we get vs equal to 40000 potential okay and now now here for the step down transformer we have using here directly proportion np upon ns equal to vp upon vs remember here this ratio of the number of turns will be changed in this ratio according to the transformer step up and step down so here you can see that at the case of step up transformer they are inversely proportional and step down transformer here number of turns is directly proportional so here in this case np upon ns we have to find out and vp means potential in primary that is uh, we have already given that 4000 40000 sorry 40000 volt in this case and secondary we have given 200 so here 20 cancel out and 21 are 2 200 so therefore np is to ns that is the ratio is 200 is to 1 so now here first option is correct i hope so you understood this question thank you for staying till the end of the video and i remind you those who have not subscribed yet do it immediately by pressing bell icon thank you take care bye bye